Hello, thank you for watching Wise Old Consumer. So this is my Fitbit charged. I've actually had it for a uh, few years now. Uh, this, so you see it's a bit worn and starting to fall apart. Um, so the charge isn't uh, actually, I guess it's not waterproof. It's uh, water resistant. So it's meant to be sort of splash proof. And uh, I guess if it's raining, it would survive. However, um, you're not meant to submerge it in water. So um, last week, I got quite a bit of water in it. So as you can see, there's quite a lot of uh, water or moisture inside the actual display itself and um, the Fitbit itself uh, wouldn't turn on. However, it's now been about uh, six days later and um, most of the moisture is actually, I guess, evaporated and it started sort of semi-working again. So it is turning back on now. However, the date is uh, incorrect, so it's, uh, I guess it started sort of working just recently, but uh, that's the March the 9th. Today is actually Tuesday the uh, 14th of March. So the time is actually about a day after when I was last able to sync. Also, I've actually uh, worn the Fitbit for a few steps uh, just then, and it doesn't seem to be recording steps anymore, so it's still zero. So I'm just gonna have a go at syncing it now to see if it still syncs or whether the water has uh, damaged that completely too. So let's see if it syncs. So yeah, as you can see, it last sunk at March 8th. Oh no, it just sunk, oh, it's just updated. So it looks like it might be back. Uh, so the Fitbit is managed in sync, but I've just taken a few steps with it and it's not uh, recording any of my steps anymore. So um, maybe the sensor's damaged. Um, I might wait a few days to see if uh, it starts working again once the moisture maybe uh, completely evaporates, we'll see.